Hello from Yokote City Tourism Promotion Organization. We are in the Tohoku region, Japan, in an inland area called Yokote Akita Prefecture. The area is characterized by hot summers and heavy snowfall in winter. The Winter Kamakura Festival has a 430 years history and is part of the traditional culture of the snow country of Yokote. The experience we would like to promote now is Kumiko Woodwork, made using time-honored traditional techniques. Product labor assembly assembled using delicate skill and techniques can be experienced in the short time. Enjoy the experience that let you fully appreciate the craftsmanship involved in fitting the wood together and pleasure of completing a product. I'm Michael Noe from Edo Wonderland. Experience 17th century Japan at Edo Wonderland. Meet ninja, samurai, and try cultural activities like archery and swordsmanship. There's even a ninja workshop for children. Watch a variety of entertaining performances. The action-packed ninja show is popular. Enjoy the day dressed in kimono. How about becoming a samurai or princess? Located in Nikko, a city famous for world heritage temples and shrines, Edo Wonderland offers a full day of fun for everyone. I'm the coordinator for international relations of Tomioka Silk Mill Division. Tomioka is a charming city in Gunma Prefecture, nestled in the hills northwest of Tokyo. Mount Miyogi, with its fantastic formations, is one of its most iconic scenic spots. The city was put in the international spotlight in 2014 when Tomioka Silk Mill was registered as a World Heritage Site by UNESCO. The Mioka Silk Mill was built in 1872 as a government-operated mill with the help of French engineers. As Japan's first large-scale mechanized silk reeling mill, it played a predominant role in the fast-paced modernization process of Japan in 19th century. Here, you can discover the evolution of silk reeling techniques and also experience traditional Japanese silk reeling. 
before mechanization, farmers raise silkworms and rid of silk manually from the cocoons at home. How about making your own silk reel decoration in the traditional Japanese way? Tomioka Silk Mill is the first hand witness of the technological innovations and international exchanges of modern Japan which contributed to making silk affordable for the general public and thus enriching people's lifestyles and culture worldwide. We are looking forward to your visit in Tomioka Silk Mill. Konnichiwa. Introducing to XNS beans from Kanagawa Prefecture, which is very close to Tokyo, the capital of Japan. The first is Chinatown in Yokohama City. Yokohama Chinatown is the largest in the world with more than 600 stores. The most popular things about the Chinatown is, of course, the food, but we also recommend experiencing Chinese cultures such as visiting places with spiritual energy and fortune-telling. The video takes you on a tour to the unique side of Chinatown with us as guide to Yokohama Masobio Temple, a temple of the goddess of the sea, and to experience traditional Chinese performing earth and flower little lighting, which is said to bring good fortune. The second is Kamakura Bori, a type of carved lacquerware developed in Kamakura 800 years ago. Come visit the old capital of Japan to discover the craft which originated from altar fittings for Zen Buddhist temples. Why not try learning this intrinsically Kamakura style under the direct guidance of our Kamakura Bori craftsmen? They will help you learn to make your own personal trays, dishes, plate, and other various goods. After completing your work, it will be passed on to a master lacquerer for several coats of lacquer and then shipped to your home, so that you can cherish your experience of Japan. And for more personal touch, custom designs are available. How do you like it? Please do come and visit Kanagawa and experience all that we can offer. We look forward to welcoming you. Hello, the North Shinano Tourism Federation is a cooperative tourism organization made up of 13 municipalities in northern Nagano Prefecture, including Niigata Prefecture's Nyoko City. Japan's largest river, the Chikuma, flows through this mountainous province that feels like the homeland of Japan, featuring spots like the renowned Japanese painter Katsushika Hokusai's beloved town of Obuse, the famous hot spring village of the Nozawa Onsen, and the world-renowned Snow Monkey Park. This region is also blessed with abundant winter snow that visitors can enjoy at its many snow resorts. There are countless activities characteristic of North Shinano's natural beauty for visitors to enjoy the snow-covered Kamakura Snow Hut restaurant in Iyama, cycling along the banks of the Chikuma, trekking under an avenue of 400-year-old cedar trees on the path to Kugakushi Shrine are just some of the activities that await you. Among these, there is one experience that can be described as once in a lifetime, the Zenkoji Temple experience. As the hub of this region, rich with natural beauty, Nagano City has a history spanning over 1,400 years and is the home of the ancestral Buddhist temple of Zenkoji. Priests of the temple carry out a morning ritual without fail every day as dawn breaks over the temple walls. Visitors can partake in introspective experiences such as sutra copying and zazen meditation, during which they may come closer to understanding the mysteries of the mind. They can also spend the night in a shuku bowl, or temple lodging, which offers an enlightening look into the Buddhist experience. Oh. 
come and visit this land rich in history, culture, art, and nature here in the heart of Japan. Konnichiwa and hello everyone. My name is Brian Takano and I'm with the tourism promotions team of Gifu Prefecture. So, Gifu Prefecture is located in the very center of Japan, right in between Tokyo and Kyoto slash Osaka, just north of Nagoya. Today, I want to briefly introduce three activities that take advantage of the prefecture's grand outdoors and timeless traditions. So, the first is quite a rare activity. Frozen waterfall trekking in an area that is famous for being home to over 200 waterfalls that are over 5 meters tall. You can actually touch a frozen waterfall. While this is only available in winter, there is standard waterfall hiking and even canyoneering available for the rest of the year. The next activity I would like to introduce is samurai knife smithing with the certified katana swordsmith. Seki is a Gifu city that was famous for its samurai swords in feudal Japan. And today, the industry has evolved into one of Japan's largest and most well known knife and bladed tool production areas. There are still 10 practicing swordsmiths in the city, which creates an opportunity to see traditional katana swordsmithing or to even pound out a knife yourself. The last activity I would like to introduce is not for the faint hearted. Gifu is now home to Japan's tallest bungee jump experience. I was actually able to try it out myself. And I did a free fall of 215 meters for about seven seconds. It was one of the most exciting things I've ever done, and I guarantee you it will make your trip to Japan even more memorable. A trip to Gifu will naturally be an adventure, so see you in Gifu! Hello, today I, Ias Tokuga, will introduce you to the fascinating efforts of Nagoya. I am the famous military commander from Nagoya who made Ero Shokunate. As a cosplay host here in Nagoya, the birthplace of the World Cosplay Summit, which brings together cosplayers dressed as characters from manga, anime, video games, and other media, strives to welcome fans with. And parallel hospitality so that they can enjoy some of Japan's best cosplay and anime experiences. Official cosplay spots include historical buildings and an array of other authentic locations. From classical to modern, you will find every kind of scenery from around the world. Now, please enjoy. This video showcasing the efforts of cosplay host and Nagoya. Cosplay host town, Nagoya! The World Cosplay Summit is held in Nagoya. Cosplayers are all about to meet with the cosplayers. Cosplayers are all about to meet with the cosplayers. Cosplayers are all about to meet with the cosplayers. Cosplayers are all about to meet with the cosplayers. Lots to love, cosplay host and Nagoya. Visit the city's appealing slate of official cosplay spots to find your very own special spot. If you are interested, search cosplay host and Nagoya on the internet. My doll, we are the Osaka Convention and Tourism Bureau. Osaka, the nation's kitchen, is unique and Japan's friendliest city, famous for its neon lights and giant food sculptures. Yet, when mentioning Osaka's charms and strengths, it would be impossible to omit sports. Why? Because Osaka is a city of sports. Famous sports equipment and sportswear companies, such as Mizno and the Sun, were founded right here in Osaka. In addition, you can also watch professional sports games all year around baseball, soccer, basketball, rugby, sumo. 
last, as well as watching sports, you can also enjoy outdoor activities. Among all the sports, cycling is the most highly recommended activity. In Osaka City Center, there are many shared cycle hubs, making it easy to rent a bike and visit famous tourist spots, such as Osaka Castle, Umeda Sky Building, and so on. If you want to be more active, we recommend Kashiwara City and Habikino City route. Both cities are surrounded by a rich natural environment. Even though the steep slope continues throughout the ride, don't worry as e-bike will assist you during the journey. Using e-bikes, which are made in Kashiwara City, you can visit the barnyard, winery, historical shrines, and world heritage sites. On a bicycle, you will discover new sites that you have never noticed before. How was it? Please come and see this exciting and amazing sports entertainment city Osaka. See you in Osaka soon!